So, this is a story full of wow. As my dad and I got kicked out of town. Not really, I'm really just saying it because it kind of goes with the little like intro song thing I was doing. So I like to take a moment, just sit right there. I'll tell you how I got kicked out of a store playing with lightsabers. So basically every like comedy has that one store scene where well you know what I mean when you have either like this kid or your average Joe or Josie but for this example say it's a kid and the kid's shopping with his their mom and the kid's like mommy mommy I want to help you shop and the mom's like okay go get a can of beans so the kid goes to get his can of beans right but the can of beans is one of those like really nicely stacked displays and they just so happen to grab and take the one at the bottom and boom oh the world is gone well not really that might have been a bit of an over exaggeration but it goes something like this um excuse me we need to clean up an aisle for yes jerry it's the can of beans again just your normal monday I don't know the exact word for situations like this, but I'm gonna call them store mishaps, and I got a few of my own. So, once again, here I am. I made a list. Number one, the oopsie daisy. So, every day after school, like clockwork, my dad always goes to Walmart, unless it's like, there's a tornado, to go look at Legos. And sometimes, me and my sister have to tag along for the ride. However, on this date, there was a display of batteries, a father who likes to mess with his kids, and my sister, who is a reckless driver when it comes to shopping baskets. Everything was set in motion as my dad evilly planned as me and my sister just chatted by the shopping cart. So the aisles themselves aren't exactly very wide, so to begin with, there's not a lot of room to maneuver the basket. So as a joke, my father would gently push at the basket, making it look like my sister was going to use control multiple times. Until one time in particular, my father pushed a little harder, and my sister went with the basket towards the display of batteries. I kid you not, there was literally 10 seconds in between the push before the impact of the basket hitting the display, but no one did anything. <laughs> So, as a result, we got a crash and a whole bunch of batteries on the floor. And I'm going to be perfectly honest with you, I ran. Like, I didn't want to be associated with this mess. But, I know just running and leaving it in there is rude, but don't worry, even though I'm not in this drawing, I did come back to eventually help my father and sister with the batteries under the watchful and somewhat annoyed glare of a worker who was unfortunately nearby. Number two, the lightsabers and the security guard. Ignore the S. So, this time around, my family and I were making an errand trip to the city of Corfish Chris E. First, we went to a store I'm going to refer to as Tartar, which my family really just goes to for popcorn slushies, and my dad goes for for Legos. My mom went off to get some food, so me, my sister, and my dad went to the toy section. But then, it all went black. But not really, because you can still kind of see, because they had like generators, but for the sake of this, say it all went black and we could maybe see. We could see just well enough to go to the nearby aisle, which just so happened to be the Star Wars aisle, and we grabbed some lifesavers and did the only logical thing. So obviously, we turned the lightsabers on and started fighting. It also lighted up the area. Unfortunately, it also drew the attention of a security guard who asked us if we could follow him out and to please stop. So we didn't put up a fight, put the lightsabers up, sadly, and followed him to the exit. Number three, the accident, throw and run. So you know how some stores have like bouncy balls in cages and sometimes these bouncy balls just end up in weird places? One time my sister found one and asked me if I could please play with her. And even though in my mind I know you're not supposed to do that, what could go wrong, right? We started playing catch, I had fun, the ball went to me, then to her, then back, and yeah. 
sad until my sister decided to go super sane and was like, wow, I should hit this ball as hard as I can. My sister hit it very hardly, couldn't exactly tell how fast it was, and went over the shelf and hit a very annoyed Walmart worker who seemed pretty mad. Mad to the point where she wanted to run after whoever was responsible for this, so my sister and I went to the doll aisle and looked like we had been there the whole time. Number four. Um, excuse me, it appears a child has thrown up. It started with a family trip to a city to just simply run some errands. This time we even stopped to get a drink and some cake pops. Pretty nice. And so we were off and the next thing I knew, we were inside the store. We went off with our father and I didn't know it yet, but my sister's stomach wasn't exactly having fun with her, her car sickness and the food she had just consumed. Now I'm not going to make a puking sound because that's kind of gross, but let's just say she kind of just went for it. And I was just freaking out in the background. I took my sister to the restroom and my father went up to a worker and said, um, excuse me, it appears a child, not mine, has thrown up in the aisle. Bye guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you liked, so I'm going to do what all everyone does. Maybe like and sub, it's up to you.